and here this is an analytical one um, it's uh, really really sophisticated and uh, uh, it is constituted between two detectors uh, here uh, we have the, the the diode array detector and we have also the fluorescence detector and uh, we can use here a high pressure until 1000 it's really really um, um, a recent uh, apparatus to make some analytical uh, study if you have um, a plant or product you would like to uh, make some analysis to make the composition to identify the different <coughs> constituents present in your, um, uh, in your sample you can use the analytical one and I, uh, I, I forgot to um, to point out about a very important uh, thing which is the degaussian unit yes. so here you don't need to make to put your uh, solvent inside a sonicator to sonificate them in order to uh, get out the gas from your uh, uh, solvent so you don't need to do this task it is uh, uh, it can be did automatically by these units okay so it is equipped uh, by the guessing unit uh, so it's uh, really really uh, fast and uh, really practical um, I forgot also to mention that uh, the here we have the column so in fact we have uh, a variety of columns that you can use uh, the characteristics or the features of uh, those columns are very very thick yes they are very very thick and uh, really expensive so you need to um, right to order them uh, if you would like to uh, make some <laughs> Uh, depend of what you are analyzing if you have some complex uh, uh, constituents in your uh, in your uh, sample so you will need to try a lot of columns uh, in order to find eventually the right one which would be suitable and more convenient with your uh, experience right this is it so uh, here the analytical, the preparative one.